what's up guys welcome back to another video today in this video i'm going to review the mui mix 12.5.1 rom and you guys may be thinking why i am reviewing that rom after a long time because mui 12.5.1 has been released a few months back but i'm uh, going to review right now because i thought i should try uh, that rom once so that's why i tried and i got really great results so that's why i'm going to uh, share it with you guys so now let's get it started so from settings you guys can see here the MIUI mix version and every single specs you guys already know about that so now we have the default kernel which is PARF uh, the MIUI always used and here is the updated security application which uh, uh, I manually installed and you guys can install any uh, a Chinese based uh, applications which has been released for MIUI 12.5 and this is the it looks and let me show you the game turbo settings and this is a uh, CPU throttle so let me open the application first so game turbo boosted successfully you guys can see the message uh, this is the game turbo setting you guys can see a performance optimization and bandwidth priority so that you guys can get a stable connection while playing games and uh, uh, in terms of gaming if you guys want to play games like call of duty mobile and you guys already know that call of duty has released their uh, season 8 and this is really cool uh, so this is really cool for Redmi 7 and Redmi Y3 users, you guys can now play games easily and enhance experience. We have something here, it so that's the feature you guys can see turn off brightness, turn off reading mode, everything you guys can restrict uh, while playing games. And I'll show you the, game the games uh, for showing you guys the game turbo. And if you install the latest security application, then you guys will get that. Uh, a new game turbo for Redmi 7 X actually and if you guys want to change performance just click here and you guys will get that balanced mode and performance mode so you guys can easily use that thing and this time it works really great and gaming performance is really improved and you guys can play Call of Duty easily if you guys want to play Call of Duty easily you guys can play games uh, actually this is the gaming MIUI ROM actually you guys can see so this is the game turbo actually you guys can easily use and where is the clear memory dnd screenshot record settings turn off screen casting everything is get and new settings which is timer you guys can enable and easily you guys can use floating window from here and let me show you the uh, security applications uh, version you guys can see uh, 6.5 which is you guys can install this one and manually and let me show you the gallery and which is also latest you guys can see you guys can get all images here if you select that and if you uh, click on that uh, camera then you guys will get the captured photos only and you guys can easily edit anything if you want here is the features And let me show you another thing which is uh, I manually installed while taking a screenshot you guys will get uh, an editor like this and you guys can see the colors from here and you guys can uh, make the scale here and you guys can see like the thing you guys can mosaic like this it works and you guys can write anything or design or you guys can erase anything so every single features is available here you guys can easily use and i'll drop the link just uh, install the mio editor that's it uh, gallery editor so those the things and let me show you uh, the smoothness of that rom you guys can see it's working just like and the ram management is really cool and it's working really great no issues on RAM management and everything is just working pretty much fine 
you guys can see and my suggestion will be for you guys uh, don't install unnecessary applications uh, like you use any application in a uh, single time just like in a one month um, after one month after one month you keep using so just uninstall that application and well when you need that application just install that time so this is the way actually uh, the less applications the maximum performance you will get so no issues and let me show you the default camera you guys already know about that so this is the default camera and it's working pretty much fine no issues anywhere you guys can use and check that this is the ram management is really cool no issues on that and i play call of duty for a long time and battery backup is really cool in terms of battery backup and performance i got it better than the eu and the uh, hellas room so you guys can uh, give it a try and on theme section you guys can easily use any third party themes so here is the import option you guys can see you guys can use any third party application and i have already imported uh, two themes so you guys can use like this and i already uh, made video on that gcam and gcam is working pretty much fine and it doesn't take uh, so much time like the previous the previous gcams and it doesn't take so much time you just click and it will take few seconds to process your image so you guys can easily use so watch that video first and this is the uh, ios style recent menu if you guys want to use that thing then you guys can uh, watch my previous video i already provided that video uh, this is a modded launcher you guys can use uh, actually this is a magic module you guys uh, flash through magics uh, let me show you that here is that file you guys can easily use if you want to actually and on a status bar everything just pretty much simple and everything is working just flawlessly no issues and so this is the way actually and now let me show you some basic things the safety net which is by default pass so this is the thing so here you guys can see the uh, safety net is passed no issues on that and let me show you another thing uh, which will be the geekbench score and which is surprisingly really really better than the helas and uh, the previous one which one uh, the eu rom and let me show you the history so you guys can see two double six and double one four eight and which is really cool for that android 10 and this is really good and this is higher uh, higher than the android 11 rom and android 12 port as well and which is left the cpu throttling i have taken the screenshot and these photos you guys can see uh this those photos are taken with that gcam i already showed you guys and this is really cool isn't it this is really cool so click on all and you, will, you guys will get everything here and so here is the CPU throttling and which is 78 percent and I ran it for five minutes so this is the all things actually guys if you guys want to use that ROM you guys can easily use no issues on that and if you want to play games like Call of Duty and this Call of Duty uh, has become now uh, yeah 4.1 for zb and i already uh, installed it and every resources uh, is not downloaded yet and if i download then it will be more than 5 gb maybe so you guys can play now this game easily i played for a long time no issues you guys can easily play so that's the video guys for today if you guys really like that video then do subscribe and hit the bell icon and never miss the further update